This is a story, a true story, of the power of science and the magic of growing things from a tiny seed. It started out as a normal school gardening project. None of us had any idea where it would lead. Maxwell, I brought in this plant. It looks a little wilted. Can you look at it for me? Sure, Mom. I just leave it over there. Okay, maybe it needs fertilizer, or maybe it's just getting water out too much. Maxwell, what did you do? What? You grew dinosaurs. How did you do this? Welcome to Scholastic Park. It started out innocently enough. This was just an ordinary greenhouse. Then something mysterious happened. We still aren't sure how, though we have a pretty good hypothesis. Somehow, prehistoric seeds made it into our greenhouse and got planted in this pot of super rich experimental soil. I've always been great at making things grow. My mom says I have a green thumb, but this one plant was something I'd never seen before. As it grew bigger, the other third graders and I did some careful research to try to figure out what it could be. Finally, it became clear that this plant was an ancient form of cicadioid that dated back to the Jurassic period. That's 200 million years ago. As the plant got bigger, I noticed that the lizards from the garden really loved this plant. They would nibble on its leaves, climb all over the branches. They basically made it their own little world. Then, I noticed that the lizards started looking different. Stranger. Stronger. It was like they were becoming dinosaurs. I can't believe you did it! You grew dinosaurs! Well, I'm not sure that was me, but something is sure happening. The bigger the prehistoric plant grew, the better the rest of the plants in the greenhouse did too. It became an amazing little ecosystem in here. The problem was that the dinosaurs kept growing too. I kept it quiet for as long as I could. Dinosaurs are pretty shy, so they usually hide when anyone comes in the greenhouse. But now, I guess the secret's out. When the adults find out, they'll be all over it. They'll want to study it and maybe even try to make money from it. That's awful. This is such a cool place. I won't tell anyone. Deal. So, we kept our secret and grew the dinosaurs bigger and bigger. Until one windy day, the flap to the greenhouse blew open and they escaped. Then, what started out as a fun secret turned into a big problem. Think about it this way. If you want a plant to stay small, you keep it in a small pot. Once you transplant it to a larger pot, the plant gets bigger, fast. Somehow, the same is true with dinosaurs. Once they got out into the big, wide world, they grew fast and got wilder and wilder. What started out as cute little lizards were suddenly adult-sized creatures that caused havoc and chaos all over campus. Don't tell me you didn't see that coming. C, 
Seriously, dinosaurs are fierce, fascinating, and not meant to live together with humans. I never understood how true that was until today. I'm relieved to just be able to spend time in our greenhouse with the plants again. Quiet, peaceful time, no drama, no disasters, just me and my plants. Thank <laughs> you.